your, your thoughts on on the status quo as it is right now, the idea that they're they're throwing all of this at Trump and they're saying that Trump's the crazy mobster in this situation. Well, if anyone's guilty of a conspiracy to deprive rights around the 2020 election, I think we've proven it's the FBI. Yeah. Hey, Merrick Garland, the call is coming from inside the House. It wasn't Trump. It was the FBI out there trying to shape the information domain so that people didn't have access to the information about the very real crimes that were being committed by the Biden family. And, and just for a moment, let's take the defense and the facts most favorably to the Bidens. What they're saying is that, well, everyone's engaged in familial influence peddling. This is just how Washington works. You take money from foreigners who want to influence our government and you convert that into policymaking for them. And gosh, the reason that's not a crime is because it's so pervasive. So the, the defense that you're a sleazebag, not a crook, doesn't really work too well when you're about to face another presidential contest. And uh, with what we see from Jack Smith, it sure is something that we've just now found out that the third member of his prosecutorial team, a donor to Joe Biden's presidential prospects and other Democrats, uh, not a lot of Trump donors on the Jack Smith team. They're not even hiding the fact that bias is built in to this double standard they're executing.